my name is Phil Warren, and my wife, Danette, and I own Tucannon Cellars and the Sugar Pine Barn. And we operated it. We've been doing it for about seven years, and we've remodeled it, fixed it up, and made the wedding facility what it is. My wife got me started winemaking by buying me a winemaking kit. I started making wine in the garage. The real treat is to get in and start making, get your feet wet. That's how you start making wine. Get in there, get your feet wet. And this neighborhood is so good to help you. The winemakers around here are really awesome about offering information, answering questions, and it's, it's a neighborhood. At the purchase, we decided that this place was a good opportunity to build an event center and have weddings. My son got married in Austin, Texas, and they were three years booked for weddings. And there was over 30 different locations, and we thought, and his really wasn't a wedding barn. And so we thought, we just have a really nice wedding, we have a nice facility, a wedding barn, and it, it should be a success. And they both complement each other. You sell wine to the wedding people. The wedding people come up here and buy wine here. It's, it's, it's a cross sales both ways, it works. It works. My roles here at Toucan Cellars is I, I make the wine, I crush it, I, I do all the physical work with it, I select the barrels, the grapes, and set up the bottling, and then as far as the facility it, is concerned, I take care of all the maintenance, and I actually built the place, and so I know how it all works. I'm in charge of keeping it clean, and organized. Danette sets up most of the operations here with the events. She sketched, she sets down with the uh, future wedding couple and goes over the pricing, what they need and stuff, and then they book the wedding. Our operation here is you have two businesses that run individually, but they also complement each other. And we usually sell between three and 10 cases of wine to a wedding and we only let them use our wine because then the people that are serving the wine can talk about our wine. The wedding venue makes money. It's a, right now it's about a $7,000 a weekend pop and it should be higher than that. And uh, that's something that the future owners can deal with. Uh, they also, we, the wine, we have an excellent wine club and that's a good source of steady revenue. Everything on this property makes money. And that's what we're here for. We did what we could with it, and we still enjoy it. And I mean, we were out here this week, weekend listening to music, and the, uh, it's, it's just unending what you can do. We come in on the weekends, we expect to have a nice wedding. We sit up on the deck, listen to the words that the, the, each other is preaching to each other about their marriage, and we often get teary-eyed up there thinking about our marriage. And then it's, it's a great facility, but I think the, the, the thing that I've got to emphasize is that if you're a social person this, and you enjoy wine, you can't go wrong. Just, you'll be a success.